Welcome and thank you for tuning in. Liverpool Football Club have finally got their man. Thiago Alcantara has joined the Reds in what seemed like an endless transfer saga. Coming to Liverpool from the reigning European champions Bayern Munich in a deal believed to be worth about 20 million euros with add-ons to be included. What a wonderful masterclass from Michael Edwards. Once again, love the jokes that were rolling in this morning. Michael Edwards could sell shampoo to Pep Guardiola. He can do anything from a negotiation standpoint. Well done. Bayern Munich were delusional to think that they were gonna get 30 million euros for a player who's 29 years old entering the last year of their deal. Liverpool had all the leverage and they played it as such. So well done to the team at Liverpool who negotiated this deal. Thiago is one of the most high profile transfers in Liverpool Football Club's history. This is a very different transfer from the ones we are used to seeing at Liverpool where they're bringing on young players who are expected to get better. Thiago is at his, his peak right now. He's not gonna have any real sell-on value after signing a four-year contract. This is a move strictly to win football matches with no intent to have sell-on value later on from a, a business perspective. This is about winning and that's what Thiago does. He was a man of the match in the Champions League final against PSG, had a wonderful performance uh, for Bayern Munich in that match. And you know, he's just delivered all throughout his career. As good as it gets from a footballing pedigree background, you know, he is the son of World Cup winner uh, Mazzinho, brother of Rafinha, and he came through the ranks at La Masia FC Barcelona's famed academy back when that really meant something. And you know, after starting his career at Barca, he won the lot at Bayern and he had played outstanding football. A truly elite passer and dribbler has the perfect skill set to be a deep lying playmaker. And you know, he can play in a variety of formations, of course. But look, I think this move really pushes Liverpool further in that direction of the 4 2 3 1. I think we can see plenty of Liverpool lineups in the future where the double pivot features Thiago and Fabinho together. Then you have Minamino, Mane, and Mo Salah together uh, playing behind Roberto Firmino up top. Of course, there are so many options now. Liverpool have nine truly quality senior midfielders, an embarrassment of riches in the middle of the park. Look, if the Reds can sign a fourth choice center back after signing Costa Simicas, uh, from you know, Olympiacos, it's an A-plus transfer window. It's the perfect transfer window for Liverpool. Literally, all needs will be met, and there's nothing to complain about. So Thiago will bring a cutting edge to Liverpool. He will bring skills that Liverpool supporters are not used to seeing from midfield play. And of course, he will bring wonderful experience pedigree. Already speaks wonderful English, too, uh, as well. So I can't wait to see what Thiago brings to the table for Liverpool Football Club. It's a very exciting time to be a Red supporter. Thank you so much for tuning in, and please subscribe to my channel.